So his legendary chin holds up despite getting knocked down in that previous round. DC, take us through the highlight. He's as tough as they come. There has not been a guy that can take shots like this. Most times the night would be over. And gladly, gladly over after you take a shot like this. But this man is just too tough. Some people say he's too tough for his own good. He would not agree with you. He wants to fight. And just like that, we have arrived at our right. second round. Robert Whitaker. Yeah. Go, guys. Versus Fight. the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Oh, beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Nice strike. Oh, nice combination there by Adesanya. Looking to land the leg kick now. There's no give on that leg kick. Whoa! and now you're starting to see visible damage on that lead leg of his head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize him. He was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. So as we call on the numbers here, 47 total strikes have now landed for Robert Whitaker. And a 45% accuracy rate thus far against Israel Adesanya. to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off. Oh, nice land with the knee. You see the taller fighter having no issue getting the limb to the target there. Straight punch land. Man, how about the steam behind that Whitaker jab tonight? Robert Whitaker is a great striker. I mean, he has it all when it comes to stand up in the boxing. And that is on full display right now. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. <laughs> well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Oh, now he stuns him beautifully with the left hand. The left hand is so accurate, so educated. He's so able to fight from both fighting stances. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Israel Adesanya. Oh, outstanding placement as he lands the knee to the body. Again, the taller fight. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Adesanya gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Got the single collar tie. Whitaker gets caught with that punch. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC, and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Good body shot. Oh, nice knee to the body. Very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Israel Adesanya's got the tie clinch. Let's see what he can do with it. Changes his stance. 
turn tonight. The biggest shot that he's landed all night. A massive uppercut range. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. So you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Adesanya's just got what a round now. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment. Round two, Robert Whittaker. And on the other side, Israel Adesanya. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, beautiful land there by Adesanya. You hear this crowd just eating out of his hand, doing it on every time he advances. I mean, he just captures your imagination from the walkout to the entrance when he's in the octagon, the fighting style. He just kind of has that thing that makes you want to stop and stare at Israel Asana. Good punch lands. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. 60 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender. Oh, huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that jet. Nice check on the leg kick offering there. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting the combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, have... order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand, jab. Oh, oh. And there as he lands and... Maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. All right, so another swing and a miss. And I'd imagine if your gas tank is this low, you got to find times to try to preserve that energy and, and get yourself back to a place where you can actually dole out some damage. Yeah, you got to get out to space. Find places to rest and recover. Get against the octagon. Go to the clinch. Find ways to just recover so that when you have that next explosion, it actually has some meaning to it. Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Seconds now to go in the round. Oh! Whitaker gets hit by that. That's a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up on I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, just stay standing and talk to your toughness. All right, so a big round for him there, DC. We'll go back and look at some of the highlights. Big knockdown for him. We'll see if he can follow it up. You could see that he was flowing. Everything was working in accordance to what he wanted it to be. And at the moment that it showed itself, the moment that the opportunity arrived, he jumped on it, got that big knockdown, and now he finds himself ahead in this fight. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Whitaker. 
slips. Ball left hook to the head, it's blocked. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves Take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Nice leg kick. Back and forth we go here. Very tricky to throw that body. Nice kick. combination of kicks there by Adesanya. Well, no problem getting inside to land that straight punch. He's got a huge edge in reach, and he made good use of it there. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! Three minutes to go in round three. 94 total strikes. Oh! He needs to start looking at the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Came with inches right there, yeah. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, that's a nice strike. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Under two minutes now to go. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Nice defense there, huge block. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. No! All, right, you ready? You ready? All right, so here we go with round one between Robert Whittaker and the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Australia and New Zealand at times are aligned. Certainly not in this matchup tonight. Not tonight, not tonight, because both of these guys both want to win this fight. They're two of the most talented martial artists in the world, and both feel as though... Oh! Who's hurt? Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. All right, first round is underway here. We say in mixed martial arts, it's one thing to have the region. Now he's trying to guillotine. He might get a finish here. Oh, what a beautiful counter to the guillotine there. Get side mount, and now maybe the Von Flute choke will be there. Open St. Crew has got to like that transition there. All right, so he postures up, somehow stays in the fight. All right, full guard here, DC. What does he need to do to improve position? Oh, looks like he's transitioning an armbar. You cannot stay in the guard of these great jujitsu guys. And attack an armbar. Continuing to try to manipulate the head here. Finishes his opponent by way of submission. <laughs> now, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes, he takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger and finishing fights. Well, you're going to have to be pretty perfect to get this guy off the throne. There he is, the UFC's undisputed middleweight champion. Complete performance here tonight.